Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How many people have voted early in the 2024 election? As the pre-election voting period comes to a close, a significant number of Americans have already cast their ballots. According to data compiled by CNN, Edison Research, and Catalyst, over 78 million ballots have been submitted across 47 states and the District of Columbia. This figure is noteworthy, especially when compared to the 2020 election. In 2020, over 110 million Americans voted early, either in person or by mail, which represented about 70% of the total votes cast. However, for the 2024 election, pre-election voting is anticipated to constitute about 50% of all ballots, aligning more closely with the trends seen in the 2022 midterm elections. In some states, there has been an uptick in early in-person voting. For instance, North Carolina and Georgia have recorded unprecedented levels of early in-person voting, although the total pre-election voting figures in these states remain lower than those in 2020, largely due to a decline in mail-in voting. The partisan composition of early voters has also shifted. In the 27 states where Catalyst has relevant data, registered Democrats accounted for 37% of pre-election votes, while Republicans represented 35%. This narrows the partisan divide significantly from 2020, when Democrats held a 12-point advantage with 42% compared to 30% for Republicans. The early voting data also reveals interesting trends in voter demographics. For example, in key states like Georgia, Michigan, North Carolina, Pennsylvania, and Wisconsin, women have cast more early votes than men, although this gap has narrowed compared to four years ago. Despite these insights, it's crucial to note that early voting numbers do not predict the final election outcomes. The results will depend on a combination of early votes, mail ballots, and election day turnout. Therefore, while over 78 million people have voted early, the final tally and election winners will only be determined after all votes are counted. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.